been a sad week for Rosebud Lott schools after the loss of one of their students. Fox 44's Mally Jones, she's in the newsroom with what the superintendent is saying about the tragedy. Mally? Adam, the community is heartbroken after the loss of Bryce Fikes on Monday. Bryce Fikes was a member of the Rosebud Lott High School cross country team. On Monday, he and his team were practicing on FM 431 when a GMC Acadia hit and killed him. Members of Rosebud Lott's staff immediately responded, performing CPR, but Fikes was pronounced dead on the scene. Some real heroes in my mind. Excuse me? Um, that stepped up that day. The route was approved in the past, but the school later changed that. Superintendent Jim Rosebrock said they are investigating why the athletes were running on that road. What were the circumstances around that decision? We do not know that yet. The head cross country coach is on administrative leave pending the investigation. The Department of Public Safety says it's going to be a while before they come to any conclusions. So we're left in hanging uh, longer than I would like. Rosebrock said the number one thing people can do to help is pray. When you are going through something, a crisis that you don't understand and there's no um, way to land on an understanding, that that is the number one thing that people can do not only for others but for themselves. His approach as superintendent is to keep things as normal as possible. My advice to the coaches is you need to look at those kids in their eyes. You need to be able to see what they're going through. They are providing counseling services and he encourages people to take advantage of that and get help. So if you're having any grief, if you're having any moments whatsoever, um, to reach out. The funeral service for Bryce Sykes will be at 10 a.m. on Saturday at the Church of the Visitation in Westphalia. In the newsroom, Mally Jones, Fox 44 News.